Another powerful state, the Principality of Galicia, Volhynia appeared on the territory of Ukraine after crushing the Kievan state. After Council of Lubyk in 1097, Galicia and Volhynia principalities were the first that separated because of the peculiarities of their geographical and economic location. During the reign of Volodymyrko, Galician principality became so strong that could withstand the aggressive plans of Poland and Hungary. Principality reached its greatest prosperity during the reign of Prince Osmomysl, but unprecedented authority was reached by boyars, large landowners, who gradually controlled the power of Prince and began to act openly against him. Principality of Volhynia, unlike Galicia Principality, was more poorer, but the process of unification of Galicia and Volhynia by Prince Roman began from there. In 1199, Prince Roman, with the support of middle boyars and their Druzhiniki, attacked Galicia, killed uncontrolled boyars, led a successful struggle against Cumans. Chronicler calls it autocrat of all Russ. In 1203, Prince Roman captured Kyiv and placed his voivode Dmitro there. In 1205, after the death of Roman, rich boyars became more powerful in the principality of Galicia Volhynia again. They wished to avoid the strong princely power and expelled his young children Danilo and Vasilko. Almost 30 years, Danilo was restoring his father's heritage and in 1238 he grabbed Galic. In 1230s, Kiev led a successful struggle against Hungary, Poland and the German knights. Further strengthening of principality was interrupted by the Mongol Tatar invasion. During 1238-1231 years, Mongol Tatars conquered almost all the territory of the once powerful state of Kiev and Rus. After the foundation of the Golden Horde, the Mongol Tatar state, all the principalities, were in vassalage. The Ruhechi, the governors of Han, were put in, in the principalities. At this time, Prince Danilo didn't stop the struggle against the Mongol Tatar yoke. At the beginning, Prince didn't admit the authority of Han. In 1246, he traveled to Batu, where he received a label to reign and admitted the power of the Mongol Tatars. However, arrived home, he continued an active foreign policy with the European states to organize a coalition against the Golden Heart. The coalition of states hadn't been established, but the Pope Price Danilo crowned him in the Rochin in 1254. After Danilo, all his descendants were crowned by this title – Leo I, Yuri I, Leo II, Andrew, Boleslav Jersey II. Boleslav Jersey I was the last prince of the Principality of Galicia Volhynia. Although he was of Polish origin, but provided the independence and identity of the Principality. After his death, murder, in 1340, the Principality became the object of political interests and the aggressive policy of the Kingdom of Hungary and Poland. The Principality of Galicia Volhynia can be called the first Ukrainian state and the successor of Kievan Rus. Unlike to the eastern and northern lands, modern territory of Russia, this state had a significant effect of Mongol Tatar dominion, was rather the state of medieval Europe had kept the independence and identity which later was manifested in the new state firms the Cossacks Republic and the Hetman State.